Welcome to another Untrained video. In today's video, we're going to do a solo Rex Riches on a 50 population Washington server. This video is intense, so make sure to drop a like if you want more videos like these. Let's aim for 200 likes. Also, subscribe to not miss any future videos. Each one helps the channel grow more than you think. Lost videos with the good giveaway winners show now. Today, we're going through another one, which is a wealthy hydration pack. To win this, make sure that you have liked, subscribed, and comment something below. Channel members also have a higher chance of winning. Alright, boys, Washington solo. I have absolutely nothing. Uh, there's a naked dude here. Now, there's over 50 people on the server, which is something that I have not seen in a while. Especially on this server, it was kind of dying out, but it's nice to see that there are more people playing on it once again. So, I do have some plans today. I do want to get myself perhaps a Rex to Riches. Having high population on a medium-sized map is not really that easy to actually progress before, because wherever you go, there's going to be people. There's gonna be people either naked or geared, you already see two dudes over there by the bridge. Here's Schofield shots, there's a guy over there as well. So what I'm gonna try to do today is I'm just gonna progress, try to get myself a Rex to Riches, maybe get some raiding gear, as much guns as possible, and get myself a, a base down as well. That would be my my idea. I have no idea. Wait, this guy, wait, this guy doesn't even realize about me. Yeah, I got myself a knife. Oh, he's gonna, ch yeah, he's gonna kill me. Bro, stop jumping around. There we go, he's dead. Ah, we got ourselves our first gun, Avenger, insane. All right, let's salvage all of these. So, what we're gonna try to do, obviously, is we're gonna try to go to maybe Seattle and I already saw a bunch of people over there. So, there's probably, uh, probably gonna die. Oh, he's coming back. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. I got punched twice and I'm dead. All right. All right, well, let's suicide and hopefully we'll get ourselves a better spawn. All right, let's swim to the other side. Maybe we'll get ourselves like an ego fire or something. And we'll go to scorpion or something like that. Oh, there's people in here. Oh, one guy dead. Oh, I'm dead. He had a... Uh... You know, I think the first dude I killed actually had some guns as well. All right, we're over at melee. I'm gonna try to go to the checkpoint over here and we'll go try to see oh there's so many people bro bro there's so many people as well there's like six dudes on the other side yeah i have no idea how i'm gonna progress alone honestly i need to try to make some sort of play even though i'm currently naked with no base i got myself a sabre looks like somebody actually did loot here yeah there's an empty heartbreaker i'm actually gonna take that just in case i get myself a magazine yeah, so I have a saber too, no attachments, nothing, no extra mags, no meds. And we're going to go where all of that action was. Grizzly shots as well now. Yeah, there's a live sky base too. Bro, it cannot get any worse than this. Today's video is sponsored by Pine Hosting. Are you guys trying to set up your own network for Unturned? Then look no further, because I got the best option for you, which is Pine Hosting. Pine Hosting is very easy to learn, the notification is super user friendly and not hard at all to master. The servers all have high performance with DDoS protection. When I started my own network a while ago, I had no clue how to do anything, but after a few minutes of looking around, I learned the basics shortly. They have locations all around the world, and the pricing is super worth it. They also have a variety of game servers to choose from, including Rust, Arc, and also Minecraft. A game changing feature is the ability to install plugins and mods just by clicking once. Also, if you have a server with another provider, you don't have to worry because Pine Hosting will help you move your servers. Make sure to check out the link below and use the code LDG for 30% off and let's get straight back into the action. Oh, there's a dude right here. Oh, bro, he has heartbreak. Oh, oh, he has a fully decked out heartbreaker. Uh, I'm getting out of here. I'm not risking this heartbreaker. Uh, I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I'm at 8 HP. Bro, I have no meds. Salvage these. Oh, I'm getting out of here. There's like 10 people around military. If I stay here, I am going to die eventually. Yeah, they're jumping off the sky base. I need to build a base ASAP. Let's turn off the mythicals. If I manage to survive this and actually build a base, I'm gonna be so happy. Yeah, it looks like the checkpoint is clear as well. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the farm. I'm gonna try to get myself a chainsaw from a zombie. And then we will uh, start building the base. So I did look around. Um, no chainsaw. So I'm gonna have to chop down trees with my knife. Gonna take a while, but I guess it'll be worth it in the end. At least on the server, there are multiple logs being dropped from each tree. Not just two or three. It drops at least like 10 logs per tree. Alright, so the base is done. Got myself a one by one till now. Now let's get ourselves a generator as well. Now I'm just gonna have to make myself some storage and then we'll go to Seattle. And let's see if there's people there. If there are, we'll try to kill them. If there aren't, we'll just try to loot a bit. I have to salvage that heartbreaker to make us all. It's empty anyway, so whatever. Alright, there we go. We got ourselves a crate. Let's put that in there. Now we'll depot the sabre, the saw, and the horizontal grip. That's literally all the loot that we have. And we'll put this um this gas can in there as well. Alright, lovely. There's a dude there. There's another dude in the bank. Alright, this guy is dead. 
Uh, their dude has a Viper. Eh? Gonna try to push forward this guy's loot. This is the guy that killed me over at Everett. In the gun store, yeah. Heartbreaker, blowtorches. Oh, there's pu they're pushing me around. Alright, one guy dead. Yeah, dude behind me. There we go, he's dead. Yeah, this was the duo that killed me over at the gun store. I remember them. Alright, so we got Steelies. Blowtorches. Chainsaw, that's really good. Shadow as well. Alright, I homed. I didn't loot the Viper dude because I actually did not want to lose this loot. We'll just go back, it's really no problem. Plus, he only had a Viper, so I don't really care for a Viper that much. Alright, so since we got a chase, I'm just gonna chop down trees and we're gonna make as much more storage as possible. Alright, so I depot everything I don't wanna lose and let's go back to Seattle and try to get ourselves even more kills. Oh, there's a dude right there. My guy was just chopping down trees, what? Oh, yeah, he's building a base. Oh, yeah, the chains on a crossbow only. I'm actually gonna take these logs so that I can upgrade my base. I wanna make the base a little bit bigger than a one by one, you know? I right, got ourselves two floors. Got ourselves another chainsaw too, that, that's actually pretty nice. So that we always have a backup. Wasn't really the loot that I was expecting though, to be honest, but... Hey, it's better than nothing. Yeah, we could do another foundation over here. And then we'll just salvage the wall. Gotta get myself a bit more logs though, but... That's okay. I go get myself... Oh, there's people behind me. Why is that? Bro, he's geared. What? He has a least back. Oh my god, he has Grizzly too, what? Yo, another chainsaw as well. Yo, there we go, we got raiding gear. Kind of, but still better than nothing, man. And then a lease pack, that's huge. This guy just literally delivered all of this loot to my base. Shout out to him, man. We can also make lockers now. We got ourselves a blowtorch. Yeah, let's finish this part of the base before he comes back with five charges. Either that guy just found literally everything and wanted to build a base or something, or he's just roaming with Grizzly and the bed. Kind of weird. Alright, there we go. We got hopefully enough logs to seal up that part of the base. Now we got ourselves another pillar. Let's put that there. A few walls. And we're gonna make another one and then just two roofs. Oh, I don't have enough. I need to get more. Alright, that's home. We literally need like one more log. There we go. Alright, and our base now is slightly larger. Let's put that over there. Alright, beautiful. Now we can move the bed and we can make all of these planks into even more storage. Not too bad. Claim this. Alright, lovely. There's a dude in there. Oh, okay, wait. My wall hacks. Yeah, they did not register. Wait, okay. Try to kill me with a cobra from there. That's actually mental. Alright. Let's see what bro had. He had a backpack. We'll actually take that. Monster key. Some meds. Cobra, yeah. Didn't have anything that good, unfortunately. We'll take that glow. Oh, there's more shots. Oh, there's heartbreaker shots, too. Oh, yeah, he's there. One guy dead. Wait, no, I only killed one. Bro, there's a dude pushing me as well, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's right here. What gun does he have? I think he only had a sport shot. I'm not gonna bother looting him for now. Then we'll just return. I wanna get the loot of the heartbreaker, dude. Wait, what? I hear a bro in a car. <clears throat> bro, there's so many people, man. Alright, he's dead. What? There's somebody taking goss as well. Bro, this server is crazy, man. He had nothing. He had food and, and goss. Alright, let's see what bro had over here. Oh, Saber and Peacemaker will take that. Bro, you just killed. I don't even know how many people we just killed. I'll go check out the brown tower and then I'll home. I wanna get the heartbreaker loot. There we go. We got some more ammo as well. <laughs> we literally just killed so many people. And there's probably much more as well. Alright, so we gotta do some parkour over here. There we go. Perfect. I don't even know which floor I... Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh, wait, what? Wait, where's the heartbreaker, dude? Wait, I thought I killed him. There we got ourselves a spec ops vest too. Night vision. That's really good. Yeah, I think... I think they just... Ran away then. Bro, there's so many people. I don't think it's a good idea for me to shoot. I did kind of leave everything back in base, even the clothes, and just brought a backpack and a gun. Because I knew that if I come here, I'm probably going to die. There's so many, though. I think there's, like, two large teams PvPing here. That's why there's a lot. Yeah, there's a dude right up there. There's a car coming, bro. What? Yo, maybe... Oh, there's a guy on a race car. Yeah, he's Milli Milli Gear. I'm actually gonna try to kill him then. The only way for me to kill the people in military is if they're, like, all in one place and not moving. Because the thing is, they'll just TPA back. Even if I kill three out of four, they're all TP back. Oh, yeah, this dude is just over here. There we go. He's dead. Yeah, another Heartbreaker, Saber, a bunch of raw. 
a bunch of meds. That's not too bad. Let's get out of here. Uh, I came back. There's a dude there, man. And he's quite geared. Another dude there. Yeah, I got... Yeah, there's too many, man. It's impossible. Kind of wanted to just try to push for the first dude that I killed. He had the least pack and everything, but... I think it was kind of impossible anyway. We got ourselves a Schofield. Oh, there's people around here as well. Yeah. Naked. Let's kill these dudes. Alright, sports shot dude dead. This dude has a chainsaw. Dead as well. Let's get that monster key. There's another guy in this barn somewhere. Oh yeah. Hello there. What is he doing? What's up, bro? He's just running from me. Blasted. Alright, he's dead. Yeah, I'm probably gonna head to paradise then and try to get myself maybe a heartbreaker or something. There's another dude. How are you not dead, bro? Yeah, he's a backpack. I want that backpack. There we go. Alright, so I'll take myself the low caliber over here and we'll take the scope field. There's another scope field here, but barely has ammo as well. Yeah, let's take the locale, and we'll switch to Schofield. Alright, yeah, we got basically everything we wanted from this farm, so I'll not complain. Alright, so I depot everything. Shots going on, let me take a Heartbreaker. Let's go kill him. Only a Schofield though, but still, you know. Still, we gotta kill him. Yeah, he's somewhere in this barn. One of these two barns. Yeah, he's probably in the other barn then. Alright, yeah, he's right here. There we go, he's dead. Well, we can get ourselves quite a lot of metal from this. Bunch of Schofield ammo, so... Not bad. Yeah, let's salvage those. Oh, there's somebody stepping. Yeah, my guy, alright. My guy is a bow. Yeah, we got ourselves quite a ton of metal. I like that. Really good. Oh, there's a bro here. What is he doing? Why is he jumping around like that? Oh, there's a bro here. There we go. So what I'm doing is I, I made up a plan for me to not risk my peacemakers and my guns and bays, my, my fully decked out heartbreakers, is that I am suiciding and looting wherever I spawn next to. Usually there's gonna be people there, so if I just get myself on a gun, I'm probably gonna get kills that way as well. Then when I get myself some e de decent loot or maybe some raiding gear or something like that, I would just home and depot and repeat suicide. Oh, there's people over here. Oh, there's two. Yeah, I'm dead. Bro, they're geared as well. Oh yeah, that's the plan. Now, uh, suicide. Actually, I'm home. Let's see if I... Wait, what? Okay, well, I'm getting grieved. That's, uh, that's great. Alright, well, that just encourages me even more to just suicide and loot wherever I spawn next. Bro, why are there a billion plates outside my base? What? That guy just TP'd out. I'm getting grieved on unturned. I think it may be that guy that was just jumping around because he, he, I killed him next to my base and he knows that I live there. So maybe him. It's fine. I'll just break them later. There's a bro there. There we go. He's dead. Oh, he had a skull field. A bunch of monster key ammo. Bro, stop running. I headshot him. There we go. He's finally dead. Yeah, he had a. He had just pistols, man. Nothing that good, unfortunately. There's a dude there. There we go. He's dead. Let's see what he had. If he had anything good, I'll home and do Oh, he had... Okay, I'll take the mags. I actually needed those. Right, I'm gonna go to milia military actually now. Seems like a PvP kind of calmed down over there. So I think it would be a good idea to actually check out if there's maybe any mega zombies or if there's any good loot. Alright, back from military run. There was nobody there but got myself some more loot. Wait, what? Wait, here's steps. Oh, they're still placing plates, bro. This guy has been placing plates for the last like 20 minutes. That's actually crazy. I have no idea why he's doing this too. So this is what I'm doing basically. I'm just putting everything in my storage and then I suicide. And wherever I land, I, I just loot the closest area. Yeah, he's still placing plates, man. I wonder who it is. There we go. Suicide. No problem. And we're here. And if there's somebody around, we'll try to kill him. If not, we'll die and loot somewhere else. That's really the plan. That's how we rack riches solo on a 50 pop Washington server. Oh yeah, so there's actually a guy here. He's clueless. Got myself a sight. We hit him. <laughs> and we kill him. Yep, heartbreaker. And full clothes, some extra mags. Poor dude, man. There we go. Rex to riches with a sight. Beautiful. We'll savage all of these. Got ourselves some meds. Alright, not too bad. So now I think I'm going to go to Heritage Valley, actually. Maybe we'll get ourselves a rocket launcher. If not, that's okay. Maybe we'll get ourselves soft 7 axes as well. That would be really nice to get. Alright, uh, we're home. Bro, what? What is going on on top of my base, man? 
Can people just leave me alone? Nah, this is crazy. He's just chainsawing. So I did get myself some loot from this. I got myself some high qual. Uh, Ranger, some 7x's as well. Bro, I genuinely have no idea what others oh, people. Yeah, there's a guy with chainsaw over there. Bro, I am so confused. Now he died. Bro, my base became a hotspot for PvP. There's the bows as well. This is kind of funny, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I have no idea who this dude is. He's just outside. He was screaming the N-word as well, so uh, that's perfect. I don't know what I don't know what his deal is, man. Genuinely, I have no idea what he's doing. Yeah, he's gonna die to a bow. Wait, I think he just died. Bro, I... They place plates on my roof as well. I can't get out. Look, look at this dude, bro. He's dead, obviously. I can't get out. I genuinely can't get out. My base is literally fully open. I have to destroy all of these plates somehow. And I cannot die once. So let's just, just continue destroying the plates. Oh, bro, there's another dude. Of course. Oh, he jumped down. Oh, he's dead as well. Let's med up. Bro, he's back with a saber. Bro, how do they keep coming back? Why are there so many people, man? What? He tried to punch me. Okay, he's dead, obviously. I don't even know if grieving is allowed on the server, honestly. Uh, dead as well. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put all of the loot in the lockers. Even though the good loot is in the lockers already. There we go, he's dead. Dead as well. There, we can finally get out. Let's take all of the meds. There we go. We cleared out all of the grievers. I genuinely have no idea why they're doing this. <laughs> it's like, bro, shut up. There we go, he's dead. Dead. He's in my base. Yeah, nice hawk hunt, bro. Yeah, I still can't place it, man. It's so stupid. I'm just gonna destroy the plates and close it off. Look at my poor base. Bro, they literally just placed so many plates around it. And I don't know why. Oh, shut up. They keep coming back as well. They probably have a sky base because on the server, everybody has a sky base. Yeah, I'm gonna move the loot to the locker, so if they do manage to get in, they wouldn't even be able to get it. Alright, and that is what I did. I did destroy as much place as possible, just for me enough to place one roof, and then I logged off the server. Those guys kept coming back and trying to grieve. So I took all of the good loot, and I left the server. Thank you guys so much for watching, I love that you guys did enjoy. If you guys want to see a continuation of this, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!